Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can access your online classes on your Chromebook. If you have questions during this process, you can contact the Distance Education Department by going to morgancc.edu slash hub and using the live chat at the bottom right corner. First thing we need to do is we need to install WebEx onto your Chromebook. You do this by first opening your web browser. Next, go to morgancc.edu slash hub. Scroll down to where it says for additional support and click on the online support link. Click on to install WebEx on Chromebook link. This will take you to the Google Play Store. Download the WebEx app and then add it to your browser. Open the app. Now that we have the program installed, we need to log into our class, which is called a meeting. When you open the program, it will ask you for your meeting number or URL, your name, and your email. You need a nine-digit code to enter your classroom. You can obtain this code by contacting your instructor or by contacting Distance Education Department through the live chat. Once you have your nine-digit code, enter your name. If you are a high school student, include your high school name. Enter your email, preferably your school email. Enter your meeting. Now that we are logged in, let me show you how to navigate your WebEx meeting. Take a look at the buttons at the bottom of the screen. These are your control buttons. Click on the phone icon to connect your audio. Select call using computer. To change your microphone, click on the arrows beside the default box. Hit OK when done. The icon will change to a microphone when the audio is connected. To mute yourself, click the icon. It will turn red, indicating that you are muted. It is a good idea to mute yourself during the lesson so your teacher and classmates don't hear background noise. To unmute yourself at any time, hit the microphone button again. The camera icon allows you to show a video of yourself if you have a webcam. Select Start Video. To stop displaying your video at any time, click the camera icon again and select Stop Video. The third button allows you to see other participants in the meeting, such as your host or teacher and other students. The fourth button is a chat button, which allows you to chat with the whole class or one participant. The next icon allows you to see your audio connection. Select Change Settings if you need to modify your audio connection. The red X icon allows you to leave the meeting. 